Delicious in Dungeon. That's where we are starting to watch. I think two seasons ago, Campfire Cooking in Another World was airing, and I'm telling you, I love that anime so much. It was such a comfort anime, and it had amazing animation, and just the cooking looked so good that when I saw Delicious in Dungeon coming up, airing, I was like, oh, I gotta watch this. So that's what we're doing today. So before we get into like always, hit that subscribe button, go to follow me. I know we got to hit it day and then get right into it, man. I hope they animate the cooking really well. The catacomb split. Everybody probably thought the war would end it, man. What the hell? Yeah, I'd give him, I'd give him, I, I literally gave him like the, the whole land. I like that, that our style, you know, just ink, like, uh, like oil, it looks like. Pastel, whatever you want to call it. Okay, dragon. Okay. Damn. They ain't putting a dent in them scales, though. Oh. Uh, they're all about to get wiped out. Bro, you're about to die, and the one thing you're talking about is you're hungry. No, she's about to get wiped out. She's about to get ate, ate by a damn dragon. What do you mean? Just confusion spell. Bro, all your team, your party is literally getting eaten alive. Or just thinking about food. Yeah, you look, he sold them. Yeah, you look, he sold them. Damn, bro. Damn, now they, it. they lost more food now. Damn, too quick. Yeah, they, they realized. Oh my god. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. He's, he's, he's gaining a finance degree right now. Ew, that's nasty. Oh no, she's hungry too. Hey, I should get McDonald's, man. But that's cheap. That looks crazy portionings, bro. And look like expensive ingredients for this time. Oh, he says a solo mission. Okay, that, that that's making a bit more sense. He's making sense of it. <gasps> oh. Okay, okay, okay. These guys are, they're gaining guts. They're becoming gutsy. He looks like King from Seven Deadly Sins. From the dun food from the dungeon. Y'all about to be eating like rat skewers like you're playing Dishonored. This man is being very cost effective. Ew, blowing trucks from both ends. That's nasty, bruh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Ew. Hold up. Oh, wait. That mushroom, you could probably make a mean mushroom stew. Hold up. Do you know how to cook, bro? Damn, she's tweaking the hell out. A few more ingredients. Whoa, look at that. It sounds like a spider or a scorpion. What the hell? In the middle of a dungeon? That's kind of crazy. He's going fishing in a dungeon. Basically, he's looking for silverfish. Yo, everyone in the back is looking astonished. Wait, but scorpions are poisonous, bro. Crayfish are pretty good, though, I ain't gonna lie. He got a little weird eating monster kink. Oh, wait, he do got a little monster kink. Hey, yo. Bro, at least take the poison out or something, bro. Duh, because the stalks, the way the stalks grow. It looks like tofu. Okay, I feel like... I was going to say, they're poisonous. I feel like she, like, you know, take the venom out. No seasoning, nothing, man. Man. Man, man, man. Scorpion hot pot? Who the hell is this guy? Oh, this guy knows what he's talking about. Even if he got his own butcher's knife. Wait, that thing looks like lobster. Oh, hold up, hold up. You gotta recruit this guy. You look, you gotta recruit this guy. Mushroom foot sniffer. What a crazy, crazy, crazy. And you gotta walk? Nah, you got to keep this guy on your party. What the hell? That, that thing was literally growing on the walls. Ew, 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 ew. Ew, that's nasty. Ew, she got Nickelodeon slimed. Wait, cook it. 
That's nasty, bro. Organs, bro. It's like clear through. I wish I could read that. High quality ingredient? The taste is worth it? Or is it that crazy? Portable slime dryer? Recruit this guy now! Oh, it looks like aloe. Oh, he has a kink too. Where are you getting these ingredients from? Wait, hold up. I don't think I can... I have to eat this... I mean, I have to wash this one with, with, a, with a full stomach, bro. It's like a lobster, I'm telling you, bro. Oh, that looks so good. Meanwhile, meanwhile, bro literally wanted to just boil those two things together and eat it like, like that. Like ham off a bone. Noodles? Slime noodles? Wherever it's staying, that's nasty as hell, bro. He's a dwarf? That's lit. <gasps> Let's go! He's joining the party! This guy's the go, bro. Cooking on the red dragon? That's insane! Oyakodon? That would be amazing, bro. Dra a dragon Oyakodon? <laughs> Senshi, I already love you, bro. I already love you, Senshi. I'll try- Dude, you you no, know, bro. You are not cooking from now on. Big bats, giant rats, forest goblins. It's not like a fairly odd parents. Goddamn intro. Ew, what the hell is that? What the hell is that? Why she find a skeleton right next to you? Hold up, hold up. Wait, let her cook. Let her cook. Oh no. She's about to destroy the whole thing, bro. Oh, she's ending up in a tentacle hentai. Ew! Oh, no! Under your skin? That's this... Oh, I'm starting to freak out. Damn. Ew, I must have hurt crazy. That doesn't like run the center of your forehead. Ooh. Oh, that hurt. Bro, this guy is weird. Yeah, that's what I say. You got weird. Bell peppers, cherries, grapes. That looks like peppers. Oh, let this man cook. With the animation for yo, the animation is really good in this when it comes when it's coming down to cooking. He's making a pot pie. He making a pot pie. Well, I'm starting to get hungry, but I literally just, just ate. Am I scrapping in the back, bro? What is happening in the background, bruh? He's making a tart. He's making a tart. Man eating plant fruits tart. I was right. He's making a tart. A salty tart? I don't know how I feel about that. Oh. Oh. Oh, now you want to switch up. Now you want to switch up. Yeah, bro. She got exposed. Marcel got exposed. Marcel, Marcel. Mar Marisol got exposed. Yo, y'all just left him there? What do you mean this works? Look like you just hung him, bro. Look like you just executed him, bro. That's creepy. For the first episode, I really enjoyed it. That was actually... That was actually a very enjoyable episode. I don't even gonna lie. It, it had everything. It had comedic. And you just, it had comedy. The characters are very likable, too. The animation was really good, too. And I just love... like I always love these type of... Um, these animes where like the aesthetic is just m medieval esque, you know, taverns, just those ta the tavern music. Still wearing those, those those metal plated armor. You know, you have mages, parties, dwarves. Like I just love the, that type of aesthetic. So seeing that again is awesome. Is, I just love it, dude. And like I said, the cooking animation was really good. I I I literally started getting hungry, bro. Like there's, I'm gonna have to like bring a snack with me every time I start watching this anime, bro. Cause there's no way I'm not going to get hungry. But it was still very enjoyable. I like the the plot of it, you know, is intriguing. They're going to take their sweet ass time cooking every meal they can they can think of with any type of monsters they, they come across. And uh, whilst 
journey to defeat the red dragon before it digests um the main character's sister that's all i got man shout out shout out the dwarf that guy's the goat came out of nowhere and started cooking everything for them literally saving their butts marcio she's cute and very clumsy love her lios whatever his name is cool guy kind of reminds me of lloyd from from spy family and chipmunk i'm gonna call him that guy is cool i like him that's really enough man so like always hit that subscribe button i will follow him for the end of um, before the spring season and i know we got it so just hit the big thing and i'll catch y'all in the next one